I am the true alpha male, the living legend of hair loss, and your personal hairline hero. Right? Even though this is my hairline? This is my hairline and, and I'm your I'm your hairline hero? Let's let's sort that out. And I can't help that this comment just came through right before I got in the shower. But let's check it out. I made a video called COVID-19 receding hairline buzz cut, mom disapproves. Our good friend and mature friend, I like mature friends out there. I like emotionally intelligent friends like Nexon Gaming Incorporated. Here's what he had to say, quote, Nick, your hairline seems really great. It isn't as bad as you claim. I've seen guys with worse hairlines. You're 39, so your hairline seems perfect, end quote. So let's... Let's sort that out. Yes, as we know, a couple days ago I did turn 39. Today, in real time, is Wednesday. So I've only been 39 for about 48 hours. Are you distracted by this? That's pretty awesome. So yeah, I mean, this is me just out of the shower. I, had, I got out of the shower, put on some clothes. I haven't really dried my hair at all yet because I want us to really just fathom, fathom the hairline there because the whole point of this is you can take a hairline like this, which is Norwood 2.5 with, with some thinning on top. I'm not claiming diffuse thinning, but it is thin on top. Here's what I responded to Nexon Gaming. I said, thanks man. I truly have a Norwood 2.5 with some thinning, but I have the right hairstyle and length. Plus, I'm not using any product which could cause my scalp to shine through. That's something I learned in years before. I've been doing these hair videos for nearly five years now and it used to be where I would film them outside at work where the sunlight was coming through I would put pomade in here which made this look thinner you could see my scalp my hair was shorter a lot of times because I was growing out a buzz cut but what I want to do now that you've seen my hair what it looks like when I come out of the shower now we're going to transform this simply in fixing my hair using nothing more than a towel and a blow dryer and that's it and so we're gonna, let's look at the before one more time. That's what hairline we're looking at. We've got a number three on the sides and the back. And we've got about three inches on top. Actually, I think just for you, I have something for you in my bathroom drawer. Cause you know, it's not weird at all to be watching a 39 year old man in his bathroom talk about his hair while having a tape measure. That's not weird at all, right? This is COVID-19 baby, anything goes. <laughs> so let's check out I keep saying three inches but is it so there's that's the three right so yeah I mean we're we're looking at about three inches on the longest part of my hair we're we're pushing it right it's actually more like two and three quarters if you ask me so I'll keep saying pushing three inches I really do keep that tape measure in the drawer in the bathroom in case I need to reference that in a video and I've had it in there for probably a year. So three and a half minutes into this video, you've, you've got to see my hairline with soaking wet hair, you know, so in case, and it, I'll often what I'll do is for my oh no videos, I'll purposely have been wearing a hat or put pomade in it to really expose my hairline all the way back because typically that's not how it is. So here we go. Now keep in mind that while I'm in the shower, usually what I do when I use my shampoo and I'm washing it, I'm, I put in the shampoo and I'm going back like this on the sides to help that part. And then I just kind of do like that to basically part it while I'm in the shower. People ask what kind of shampoo I use. I'll just show you. But at the same time, I'm going to tell you that I'm not faithful to a brand. We just, we shop at Kroger usually. This happened to actually come from Whole Foods. And it was on clearance, and that's why I bought it. So this is what I have. Everyday soap. Uh, Plant-based. This is coconut and lemon. So I got this on clearance for $7. I actually got three of these all together. So that happens to be what I'll be using for the next couple months. But I don't use conditioner. I And I don't even use a lot of shampoo, actually. Just enough to get any sweat out, basically. And I kind of use it. I It's almost like when I'm washing my hair, I pretend that that is pomade, basically. So that's, that's where I'm at. So now five minutes into the video, I'm now going to officially fix my hair. You saw what I did. So again, when I'm in the shower, I'm, I'm putting the shampoo in, I'm doing like this, 
and like this, which is basically sort of parting it. And now that I've got a vague part there, now I get a towel. And I know that my hair has some wave to it, so I, you can see how I draw my hair sort of in a circular motion. Like that, and I'm, I'm just trying to kind of scrunch up the, the hair there. And then here's the blow dryer. I don't put a whole lot of thought or effort into this. I just sort of blow dry it, reinforce that vague part that I've done. And really that's about all I'll do. Other than just kind of wet my fingertips and reinforce any, uh, just kind of for the shape. So again, I, wanna, I don't want spiky sides. And I don't have a disconnected part or a hard part. I just have a blended part. As you all know, I went to a professional uh, for one of the few times in my life. So there you go. My hair is done. I don't want to have this perfect look. I want it to look a little bit uh, I want it to look a little bit disheveled. Uh, I want it to look low maintenance because it is low maintenance. And in reality, if I wasn't talking the whole time in this video, from the time I started to the time I was done, I could have, it would take about 90 seconds. I've made videos like that before. I don't see need to do it again. Uh, but quite recently I've shown that I can do it less than a minute. I think it was like 47 seconds. If, if you want to go back two weeks in time and look at my videos, you'll find one where I was able to do it. That's how little I spend on my hair as far as time goes. And I love that. I think it's so important to have a low maintenance hairstyle. It makes me happy. So there you go. If I get away with making more videos today while wearing this green t-shirt, then you'll see how this ends up looking in the lighting of the garage where I typically shoot my other videos when I'm not filming them in my bathroom. Your thoughts, your beliefs, your perceptions of reality belong right here.